Hello everyone, uh, Sarang here, back again in our series of uh, facilitating a way of uh, inspiring uh, senior students or mature students for considering an option to come to New Zealand to study, uh, work and then settle down. So this is our third video in the series. I'm right outside uh, the Sai Temple here in Auckland which is at a place called uh, Hunga. So as you can see from the parking, uh, the places of religious interest are open at the moment uh, because we are down at level one. Now in this video, I'm gonna take you through some of, the, some of my journey, uh, which I had to go through as a student pursuing their postgraduate diploma in applied management. So as a student, uh, we are allowed 20 hours per week to work. Um, so there, was, there were a lot of options to work. So in retail space, uh, in Subway, McDonald's, but I wanted to do something different because I really wanted to add uh, valid experience to my customer service and training skills. So I chose a job as a caretaker at a church. It was an Anglican church which was very, very different from what I had done back home in India. Uh, but I succeeded there because the job involved a lot of administration, uh, talking to members of the public, uh, most senior citizens, and coordinating uh, with everyone around. So all the stakeholders were actually dependent on the role that I was doing there. Uh, and my second part-time job was of a business development manager. I was doing uh, B2B sales and marketing for an Ayurvedic firm. Uh, this was for an Indian doctor family who were here in New Zealand for the past 25 years. It was uh, quite a pleasure to work for a noble purpose such as Ayurveda. And I also faced a disappointment uh, in that job because uh, come March, during our first lockdown, I lost the opportunity. I was made redundant. However, uh, I had to pick up an essential services job. So essential services here in New Zealand meant healthcare, supermarkets, uh, also security or working uh, very close to the defense forces, uh, posted at hotels for quarantined uh, people traveling outside. So I picked up a job as a customer care executive in a security company called First Security. I started working at retail spaces, uh, ensuring that people stay at uh, social distancing uh, protocols. I was posted at banks, libraries, different places. And then after, I was shifted to a quarantine facility. So here they call it MIF, or Managed Isolation Facilities. I was here for uh, quite some time. In fact, uh, I still get calls. Uh, and by the time I graduated in uh, this August, after a year, I actually uh, got valid experience right from April and I picked up a job as a tutor in one of the private colleges and here I in fact teach the security course which is a basic foundation level course, level 3. Um, however, the pay is good, it's about medium wages and I, I can still do two jobs because I'm an open work visa. So this has been my journey and it's been really, really fruitful. And uh, in comparison to what I would have done back home, I think this is uh, pretty beneficial and looks solid long term. So I just wanted to share that with you.